friends, hi, welcome back to What's Cooking Coco. Today, we're gonna make something delicious. Um, who doesn't like wings, okay? I do. I just don't make them very often, but today we're gonna do that. And I'm going to do a sauce. Bear with me on the sauce, trust me, you're gonna love it. So, let's get started. What you're gonna need is some wash and cleaned wings, okay? Next, what we're going to need is we're gonna need like a little hand blender, okay? Into this, we're gonna need two pieces of garlic, okay? We are going to need a peach. If you don't have a peach and you have canned peach, I'm pretty sure it'll work, just drain out all the juice, okay? And I am literally gonna use this whole peach. This is going to be my sauce for my wings. Let's put that whole peach in there. Okay, no seed, just the whole peach like that. We're gonna use half a lemon, okay? We're just gonna go ahead and juice half of that lemon. Then we're gonna need some chipotle peppers, chipotle and adobo. I used this the other day, so I have some left over. And uh, let's go ahead and throw in one of those because these things are kind of spicy, okay? We are going to add some red wine vinegar and just a splash, just like that, all right? Add a fourth cup of water, and this is a fourth cup, okay? Sometimes I don't measure and I get called out for it, but this is a fourth cup, okay? So let's say that's about a tablespoon of salt, okay? No, that's not a tablespoon, that's, a, that's about a teaspoon. Let's do a teaspoon and a half, okay? We're gonna need some honey, and then I'm gonna grab just a few I'm just gonna pinch off a little bit of cilantro, okay? Just like that. Just to give it a little bit more of an intensified flavor, okay? Then we're gonna drizzle some honey up in here. So let's see, let's do, that, that should be enough. About a tablespoon of honey. Let's pop the top on here and let's give it a blend. We're gonna go ahead and we're gonna taste it to make sure that it doesn't need any more salt or anything else. Let me get a spoon. Mm, that's yummy. While we're, we set this aside, what we're gonna do is make sure that you preheat your oven at 425 degrees, okay? So that way, it's already, by the time we're done doing everything else, we'll be good to go, all right? So then we're gonna need a bowl. And to that, we're gonna go ahead and add our chicken wings. So now that our chicken is dried, we cleaned it, made sure that it was dried, what we're going to do is we're gonna start adding all of our spices. But first we're gonna go ahead and drizzle it with some olive oil, garlic powder, okay? And honestly, however much you want. Let's do one tablespoon of onion powder. And then let's do a teaspoon of paprika. Go ahead and add some pepper, add a teaspoon of pepper. I'm gonna say I'm gonna do a tablespoon of salt, okay? And then we're gonna need some baking powder. Two tablespoons of baking powder, okay? Let's do that. Look, we are doing this as we go. So don't be afraid to get your hands a little messy, okay? It's just chicken, you can wash them afterwards, okay? And then we're just gonna mix it very well. Make sure that we have every piece of our chicken wing coated with the spices. So our wings are nicely seasoned. So now what we're gonna do is we're just gonna go ahead and get a baking sheet, um, line it up at the bottom with parchment paper. If you have one of these catching racks, that would be perfect. If not, just use whatever you have. A baking sheet with parchment paper will do just fine. Okay, and then we're just gonna go ahead and place all of our chicken wings down, okay, on the baking sheet. So we got it all nicely lined up, okay, and now we're gonna, our oven has been preheated at 425. We're gonna stick it in. Let's say about 20 minutes on one side, then we're gonna flip it and for another 20 minutes, okay? Just like that. Okay guys, we're done. That was about, let's give it like 30 minutes, okay? So remember, halfway through, we flip them and let it cook on the other side. 
And all we're gonna do is we're gonna take them out. Look at how beautiful those look. Oh my gosh. Just like that. And remember our sauce, okay? We're gonna take some of that sauce. This is kind of like our barbecue sauce, okay? But it's so much better. And we're just gonna drizzle however much you want. And then we're gonna do a little toss. Look at that, okay? I already got my plate set here, right? And we're just gonna go ahead and plate it nicely. Guys, look at it, it's done. Now let's try it. I put some ranch in here and then I got mm, some greens, okay? Ooh, these are hot. These are still piping hot. Look at that, guys. Thank you, Lord. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Wow. Ooh, that is yummy. It's spicy, sweet, and tangy, which is yummy. You get all three flavors in one. Mmm. 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 So yummy. Y'all have to try this. It's not that hard to do. And you can actually make these, take it to a party, holiday, whichever. They're so yummy. Y'all have to try it. Mmm. So good. Mm-hmm. Mm. It's gonna get messy. Thank you so much for joining me in my kitchen today, cooking with me some wings. Sorry, I might have stuff in my teeth, but that's okay. I hope you guys try this. Try the sauce, because the sauce is yummy. If you've never had like chipotle with peach, trust me, it's kind of like a barbecue twist, okay? And it tastes really good. Make sure that you guys like, subscribe, and share. I love reading your guys' comments. I love it when you guys message me as well. All right, see you guys again next time. Bye.